Hello world and welcome to Emerging Sounds, the show that focuses on artists and how life's challenges motivate them in their artistry. I am your host, Carice Clemens, filling in for Brandon Ward, and on today's show, I speak to Broken to discuss the challenges of them being women and singing gospel quartet. Stay tuned, this is Emerging Sounds. Feeding America nationwide network of food banks to help provide meals to those in need. Join us at feedingamerica.org. About 10 years ago, the music ministry of Broken began. Since then, Broken has traveled ministering to people around the country. Although they face many challenges at times, that doesn't stop them from doing what they were called to do. How are y'all? We're great. How are you? I'm good. Y'all show look good. Thank you. With these Thank glitter you. shirts on and these skirts, y'all match too. You I'm look so nice glad. too. Why? Well, with your suit on. I'm scared of you. <laughs> now let's get started. <laughs> My first question for you all is how did Broken get started? Broken originally started as a family group. Um, it consisted of myself, my daughters, and my nieces. And we actually started singing in my kitchen. Okay. Now, how did you all know from singing in the kitchen, we need to take this further than just the kitchen? Um, basically because people just, you know, kind of impromptu started adding us to programs where they would see us come in and be like, hey, can you guys give us a selection? And so it was from there that we decided that we were going to start doing it on a regular basis. Now, when you all started the group, was the original name Broken or was it something No, else? the original name of the group was Higher Calling. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then from then, where did the name Broken come from? The name Broken derived from me studying one night. Um, I was reading about Jesus' experience in the Garden of Gethsemane and um, realizing that the place that he was was called uh, a place of crushing. And so it was there at that point I thought that as long as we're in a state of brokenness, it keeps us humble because it constantly reminds us that we've never reached the mark. So therefore, in doing that, it keeps us humble and helping us to realize that we're not operating and functioning of our own strength, but you know, our strength comes from God. So since then, how have people been receptive to the group? People have been very, very receptive to our music ministry, uh, what we do. Uh, we've uh, just gained a large uh, audience that just enjoy what we do because we enjoy what we do. So I think people feed off of our energy. So in order for people to be receptive of what you have, you have to give them something to be receptive to. Understood. Now, obviously, you all are women. How is it hard singing in a male-dominated industry of quartet? Um, I think the main focus is identity, just maintaining your own identity. Um, and knowing your lane, staying in that lane, and then being able to function uh, wherever you're planted and just keeping your originality. Now, when you speak of identity, exactly what are you speaking of? Um, I think our identity um, is that we are open to all genres of music. We don't just necessarily uh, consider ourselves a quartet group. We're worshipers. Um, so we do it all. We've had an opportunity to... Uh, sing at the Andrew Jackson building for black history functions. Um, so God has opened up a multitude of doors for us to minister to. So we don't just restrict ourselves to one genre of music, but we're open to all. Now, Rachel, were you one of the original members of the group? Were you in the kitchen with the rest? <laughs> I was not in the kitchen. However, they invited me over for a plate. <laughs> what was on the plate? Oh, Lord. <laughs> Some good old macaroni and cheese. Who could, you could. <laughs> and meatloaf and turkey greens. You remember that day? I do. Wish you could. A little bit of everything. Yes, Lord. A little bit of everything. I believe that's how she got in. They say you feed them. That's a good way to get them. 
Get him. <laughs> she got him. <laughs> she got him. Well, you, where my plate at then? Uh, we, we'll work on that. Okay, then. <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah. No, but um, I did not start with them, but I have known them for a very long time. I've actually, um, I actually worked with their mom, her mom for a long time, with some plays, black plays and things, uh, prior to coming to sing with the group as well. Um, but they are my sisters and I love them and mm -hmm. when we're together, it's a chemistry that you just can't explain, you know, um, that's genuine and that's what it's about, you know, loving each other genuinely, knowing that we're not perfect, but hey, come together and get our praise on, that's all we need to do. <laughs> now, in, now in 30 seconds, who is broken? Go ahead. Um, Broken is a ministry full of women that don't mind sharing what we have to offer uh, based off of what God has given us. And our experiences, our personal experiences, okay. we all have personal testimonies that our name in itself speaks for our challenges. So you're looking at a multifacet of trials, but we're overcomers at the same time. Amen. Later in the show, we'll see Broken perform live. Stay tuned. Shining, melting, and popping. I thank the Lord for another day and every blessing He keep on dropping. You are the Lord of Lords, and You are my Abba Father. I just want to say that I love You more than anything. I lift my hands. I lift my hands and. Take it away, oh God, uh, anything unlike you, move it out. No matter what it is, we want to be like you. No matter what it is, we want to be like you. We want to do what you say. Come on and send it, send it. Send the rain, clear me again with your holy rain. So I kept the faith, kept on believing, cause I know Jesus was down when no one else was. And his name is Jesus. I know he's a friend, and I know he'll turn things around too. When it's for real, it's forever, no matter what they may say. Tell the devil you're like, cause he's just trying to steal your shine. Tell the devil you down with the Prince of Peace, so yes, he's yours. He's the MVP, his name is G-O-D. All I'm gonna do is just praise you. Well, welcome back, performing a medley from their self-titled EP, Broken.
Look, y'all known for I recommend Jesus. So let me get a little taste of it before we get ready to go. Just a little bit of it. Don't hesitate. Let's do it quickly before we run out of time. Even if you don't know where your talent is, just know that through experience and faith, you will be guided to share your gifts with others. As you continue to be passionate about what you believe in, just remember to believe in yourself, even if no one else does. I'm Carice Clemens filling in for Brandon Ward, and this is Emerging Sounds.